Hi, this is Tony from OnlineBasicEVU.com. If you are website owner or online marketer, then this video is going to teach you how to tap into the millions and millions of people already using YouTube to get discovered and get new visitors coming to your website. Now, you are probably familiar with YouTube already or using it yourself to watching videos. Here, you are going to learn why as a, such a great idea for you as an internet marketer to using in order to leverage all of the people already there searching for what you have to offer. First of all, 4 billion videos are viewed on YouTube alone every single day. That's a lot of people. They're already waiting for you. And the people are using YouTube as a search engine as a way to find information that they need just like when you Google something or using Yahoo or Bing. The other interesting thing is, if you made a video, then that video is 53% more likely to come up in Google search result when someone is searching for something online than if you will trying to get a certain page of your website found. This is very interesting. It's easy. It's another way to get it discovered. Of course, it's a free and easy source of web traffic for you. It just takes a little bit of time to work into your schedule, and you can have consistent visitors coming to your website or squeeze page. The other cool thing about using YouTube as an online marketer is that there are two ways to win. You get to double dip in the traffic pool. The first way is to by posting a video in YouTube where people find it and watch it and either see a link or find out the web address that you want them to go to. The second way is how your video can come up as a result in search engine like I said, so that not only people in YouTube searching can find you but people just the googling randomly topic can find you. This can put you so far ahead of your competition that you might be spending months or years trying to get a number one spot. So here is how to produce and distribute your first YouTube video in three simple steps. The first step is to record a simple video. We will show you a couple of different kinds you can using to get started. It could be as simple as using your camera phone without having any software available to you. Then you are going to upload the video to YouTube and enter the certain settings that will make it easier for people to find your video from within YouTube's already large amount of traffic. Then lastly, you will want to share the video with your own friends, families, and so on in order to get the comments and the likes started. So the first step is to make a video that you are going to share with the world. What kind of a video could you make? You might be wondering. The best way, in my opinion, is to make a tutorial video that shows people how to do something, perhaps something that you are doing in your own online marketing business. Teach them how to do it and offer them a link to click on if they want to learn more. You can also make a promotional videos which advertise something that you want to offer for sale or some reason why you want them to come to your website. You can also make a personal videos that you share with your subscribers giving an update of how you are on vacation or whatever seminar you are going to and so on. But reviews of affiliate products are probably the simplest and the smartest way to go about making a video in the very, very beginning. This could be as simple as a video you're talking ahead and you make with your own phone camera talking about the product you purchased, why you got it, and the result you got. And then give the strong call to action at the end saying if you wanted to find out more, click on the link below. Or as you can see from this example here, 
you can create what called annotations in YouTube. Once you have uploaded it, then you can add it. You don't really need to have any kind of a video editing software. You can create text box bubbles like the one you see here next to Spider-Man that pop up and encouraging people to go to your website. Here you can write again your website, your affiliate link, the place that they need to go, and it's a doubly reinforced right in their face. They are more likely to click on it or type it in to the web browser and go to your link where they can subscribe or make a purchase. In step two, you are going to upload your video to YouTube and enter in the settings. We will show you to tap in so that people who are searching for what you have to offer will find your video. Once you go to YouTube, if you have an account, it's pretty simple. Just click on Upload and start uploading or submitting a video. Now you want to enter certain information to help people find you, and that information is called keywords or keyword phrases. These are the words that people enter when they are searching for something specific. So for example, if I were searching for how to build a square food garden, then build square food and garden will be the most relevant keywords. Don't worry too much about A or Z or something like that. You are going to want to name your video when you save it. The file name should have those keywords in it. I would just make a build-square-food-garden. The phrase with dashes or hyphens connect them. Then when you upload it, it's going to ask you for the title of the video. Make that keyword phrases as well or have the phrases in it, preferably towards the beginning. Also in the video description, this is where you write that what is the video about. Include the keyword phrases again and some other text explaining what they are going to learn. And very important here, the very first thing in your description should be the link that you want people to click on to buy whatever it is that you are promoting. Lastly, it will ask you for video text. This is where you take all the keywords you can think of that have to do with your video and enter them in one at a time with the commas between them, such as square comma, food comma, garden comma, build comma, gardening comma, do it yourself comma, something along those lines. Here is a leading example of this with one video. As you can see, I highlighted the title of the video, square food garden or build a square for the garden, building, etc. Were my keywords, then this title will be perfect for that. Also, take a look down at the description. They use the keyword again, build a square for the garden in the last sentence. What's missing there? That will be a link to go somewhere. It should be the very first things in your description so that people will make sure to see it without having to move down to next page to see even more. That's going to help you to get more traffic right here. The final step, once your video was made and set up in YouTube, is to share it with others. Once your video is up, then you will want to send some other people to see it, because even though some folks will find it just by searching around in YouTube, there's other things within your power that you can do to get even more people seeing it and to get the first initial comments and the likes so that when subsequent people come across the video, they will be more likely to do the same. The first thing you can do is announce your YouTube video by posting the link on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn if you use it, or other social media sites in order to let people know, here is the cool video I made, check it out. Your friends and the family will see it, or the people you are promoting to will see it. Same thing goes for your email list. Send an email to all of your subscribers and let them know you have a new video they might be interested in, and there it is. An even better way to do that is to embed the video on your blog first by making a quick and easy web page and shows the video and maybe some other text around it explaining what it is and why you put it up. 
then email the link to your subscribers because uh, frankly you want them coming to your website and not to YouTube where they may get distracted by whoever and whatever. The last thing you can do to get more people find your video and coming to your website in the first place is to post it on other video sites like Vimeo, Vidler, and so on. There's a bunch of this. Basically, I wouldn't post on more than five. Basically, just do YouTube first. This is something extra that you can do to help you get found by even more people later on. If you have enjoyed this easy traffic generation method and would like to learn new way in the future, make sure to go to www.onlinebizedu.com and stay tuned for more training and videos.